Wow. Oh no, a timer. Stop this. Cease. Now they see you. Now they know that you're here. Cease this timer. Cease. Stop this. They know you're here. Now all of China knows you're here. Hello. Hello, 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 hello. It's Kami. We have a wonderful picture of Commissar here today to help us with our art journey. Hello, everybody. Hello, hello. I made it. I made it. We are here. I have a heating pad. We're good. I don't think it'll be a two hour stream. I'll probably cut it an hour because I don't want to, you know, like I'm starting to feel better. I don't want to make things worse. So, you know, we'll probably only keep it to an hour, which is okay. You guys can keep doing this kind of stuff. It's the mic sound okay. I've edited in a different spot today. Um, I'm gonna, you know, you guys can keep going afterwards, even if I'm not here. But Zilla and Paz. Recyc does indeed send his regards. Hello, Recyc. <laughs> How's your back? It's okay. It's gotten um, a lot better, like significantly better. I think I think it was a mix of uh, me sitting so much, you know, drawing and 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 some such and what what have you. BMG is a touch louder. I like my BMG. There you go. That should help. Maybe. I'm sitting upright more today, so I had to put the mic in a different spot than I normally have it. Whoopie's bully channel announcement. Oh. Um. <laughs> So, it, it, yeah, it's in a different spot. Booby is chat. <laughs> but yeah, so I think it was a mix of um, me sitting, but then I also sit stupid because I cross my legs when I sit. So I get that uh, that wonderful sciatica going up my back, which is and down my leg, which is super duper fun. And then I think I did too much weight. Um, while weightlifting. <laughs> and, and too many reps. So I think I hurt my butt muscles on top of that. And then I also started doing uh, hit running. So I think I did that on top of that. And then perhaps I did not stretch afterwards. So, hello, hello. Oh my god, Taters is here, guys. Um, so remember when I was talking about the s'mores burger? That's Tater. Tater was the one that created that abomination, so. Hello, Clay. Oh my god, look, it's all of you. Yes, it was I. It was I, Tater. Well, it was him, Tater. Back Peter's work, gotta be careful after I hurt my back. I'm gonna snap the nerve and I can't really feel her, but oh wow, that's terrifying. I, um... Damn. Yeah, I've been having like numbness in my foot on and off, but I've had, I mean, this is like, it's kind of like a normal thing I deal with now, which is this was a really bad flare up with the timing of everything else. So that was very, it was like three issues compounded into one, which is why it was kind of bad. So. For being the guy who eats meat tarts, I'm calling that from now on. Hello, Robo. Don't be sad. It's okay. Just need to lift weight. But well, see, like what happened was I was on the hip sled, and normally my um my max on the hip sled is 280 pounds. So I was only doing 200 pounds, so I didn't think it was that big of a deal. But then I added like a lot. I added like an extra set on, and I was doing more reps. And I was doing more reps too. So I think it was just a big perfect storm of stupid. Oh yeah, put those meat patties in the toaster. That would have been a good idea. No, I'll spark you stinky. I did, yeah, it was a big mess. <laughs> and then I also didn't stretch after, so. It was a whole perfect storm of stupid. Well, uh, Gob, if you would like to, there is a link to donations in the in the description. So, not necessary, but if you would like to, they are there. <laughs> he runs accurate. Hello, but yeah. So, uh, what we're doing today, or you can donate via coffee. That is also a thing you can do. Um, but yes, there is a donation link in the description below. Either way. Um, 
to what we are doing today. No balls. As we're gonna take the shapes that we learned last week and we're gonna apply them to animals this week. And I'm doing animals instead of people um, because uh, animals seem to be easier than people. They're more, they're easier to break down. And I don't know why, I think there's some kind of, blah, blah, some kind of psychology around that, but. I look her up and she gets the top and almost, I saw that, I was like, how stupid can you be? She climbs to the top of the rope and grabs the rope and grabs the eye beam and then like pulls her legs up a little bit and it unhooks the rope and then she's like stuck there. And I'm like, why would you, why would you grab the eye beam? Like why? That's not, what are you doing? Like stupid. Animals do look weird also. Yeah, so um, I'm going to just use the camel as an example of what you guys should be doing. And then I have a whole bunch of other examples that we'll actually do. Um, Sorry, I get my nose is a little stuffy. Um, so I'll show you guys what we're doing. I do have a six minute timer. Um, I got some feedback the last couple ones that you guys need more time like between drawing, little mini drawing sessions. So I'll, I'll give you guys more time between them. But yeah, it should be super chill. By its full government name, Carmel Sarf, Camel Sarf. Maybe the kindergarten teacher brings back good memories. Yay! Kamsar, Kalmasar. Yes. Havoc? I don't know why it doesn't work, but thank you. Thank you, Robo, for the tip. I don't know. Sometimes they work with YouTube. I honestly don't know why. I looked at it. It's stream elements. Everything's hooked up. The tests work. There's no reason why it shouldn't work. Here, let me let me try one thing. Let me just try one thing. I don't want to derail the. I don't want to derail the stream too much. But let me just try one thing. Quick. And then if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Hold on, hold on. Let me do a test run. Don't freak out. I'm just doing a test. Okay, the test worked! Buddy, my name is Bill. Oh Jesus, it's terrifying. So I don't know. That's, that's it. Should be working! I don't know who is Bill. <laughs> Howdy, Bill. I don't know. The test work. Yeah, the teacher. Thick thighs save lives. There you go. Thank you, Robo, for the tip. We figured it out. Thank you, Robo, for helping me figure it out. I don't know. I don't. I just. I deleted. I deleted it and put it back in. I don't know. <laughs> Guess my name is Bill. Hello. So you back to back to focus. I have no idea. I don't know if the next one will work though, because um, I had someone subscribe and the alert popped up and then I had someone else subscribe and the alert didn't pop up. So I have no idea. I, I don't know. <laughs> but yes, okay, so let's get going on what we're doing today. Vi, this is my last money for food. I am now a starving uni student, but I must support my Oshi. Thank you. Thank you, Gottmik. I hope your starving ends uh, soon. <laughs> but thank you, I appreciate it. <laughs> just gotta, we just gotta get till February, and then we will, we will have Twitch back. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> Sorry. So anyway, to focus on what we're doing today, we're pretty much we're gonna break the animal animals down into shapes. Yes, this is a fact of our stream. So, for a camel, for example. This is just an example, so feel free to draw along if you want to, but not necessary. So, you know, his tummy is, uh, is a ball. 
And then he's got kind of like a trapezoidal shape for shoulders. Or like a triangle type situation. This is very rough. Thank you, Bleach. Good job. And then he's got like two, two cylinders for a neck. This isn't going to fit in the thing, but you guys get the idea. And then he's got like another, like he's got like a cone shape for a head. And then, you know, onto his legs are very skinny. Skinny cylinders. And then you can have like balls for the joints if you would like. And then, so you want to try to get it, not just draw, like, whatever the hell you want. Um, you want to try to get a similar pose. Because I picked, I did pick the mammals we're using for reference on purpose. So I would like to see you guys try to stick to the pose that the mammal is, uh, is experiencing. And then sometimes you can kind of sim simplify it into one, one solid, um, cylinder. Say ball. Ball. And his hips are kind of like a smaller triangle shape. I think even smaller, really. Caboose is hungry, I think. And then another smaller cylinder. And then you have to look because this foot is in front of this foot on like the plane. So you want to make sure when you're drawing it, you want to put this foot behind it. Sort of helio. Hello, Scout! We do be doing art. And, and thus, you have your caramel dancing. And if we want to make it Commissar, like I said we would, we'll, we will give him a little hat. Although it's 40k hats, so they're like really belligerent and big. There you go. If someone could screenshot this and post it in Meat Hall and tag Commissar, I would appreciate it. Someone could just let him know. This is now Carmelsar, Camelsar. He's here. Oh my god, it's like I can almost hear him. Gosh. I made it back to the room. Wow, it's like I can almost hear his voice, his robotic voice. <laughs> so yes, this is the basic idea that we are shooting for. So I'm gonna put up six minutes. Um, I'll give you guys a couple of minutes to prep because I gotta move on to the next one. But yes, this is the this is the gen that's this is the general idea of what we're shooting for today. So let me turn off my camel here. The first one we shall do is an easy one. It's a flamingo. Wait, what are we prepping for? Well, for the people who are drawing, Gopnik. I'll zoom in a little bit. Don't worry. The flamango. He's doing flamango things. A lot of interesting shapes in your flamangos. Look at him standing tall. Alright, so I do have a six minute timer when everyone's ready. A music note, got it. Yeah, actually, that's yeah, that's relatively accurate. Is a music note. All right, I'm gonna get my pen, and we're gonna start in that one more minute. What animal is a hyperbole? Apparently, March Against Humanity. I think you know, like. 
You've heard of an emu war, right? But like, prepare for the flamingo war. I mean, look at this lad. He is truly tall. The short birds have nothing on him. He is quite tall. Psych. Can flamingo fly? Yes, flamingo can fly. And so can chickens, as, as many have found out. Yes, flamingos can fly. They can fly. They fly all the time. They're a flight bird. They fly. Why would you think they can't fly? Chickens fly. Oh my god. Some chi I should I should rephrase that. Some chickens can fly, but they are burst flyers, so they can't like soar like geese and eagles and stuff. But they can fly. But larger breeds that are mostly made for meat cannot fly. But that's because they've been, like, genetically altered and are mutants. So. But yes, we are going to draw now. So, I'm gonna start the timer. And it is- it's starting in uh, three, two, one. Look, I got a, I got a new timer. I got a new, a new timer every time. Yes, chimkins can fly. Most chim- some chimkins- I don't want to say most. Like the- the- the foghorn leghorn type birds, they can't fly. And then, you really wanna- you don't wanna just like trace the outline of it, you know, cause you could just, you know, do like a simple- but you wanna like build it into shapes, cause that's- the- the point of building it into shapes- I'm gonna turn the BGM down, this is- this is Tad! Um, the point of building it into shapes helps you work on, um, perspective. So you can naturally figure out perspective without having to, you know, draw those perspective lines. So I would, I need everyone to draw the actual shapes, not just like draw the, the simple outline. Is what I need, is what I need from you lads and lasses. I'm trying to keep it as simple as possible. Trying not to move it too much so I don't want to like <laughs> messing with your guys' reference. You know, the more I notice, the more I like do these kinds of streams, the more I sound like a teacher. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like I'm the... Commissar! I'm gonna start turning you into a camel, like, all the time. I'm gonna delete all your commie emotes and turn them into camel emotes. I made this lad very large. Hold on. I'm gonna shrink him. Vi, what is your level of knowledge regarding maths? Especially calculus. <laughs> um, I used to know calculus. I was in uh, advanced math in Asgard. I was really good at trigonometry. It's fun. I like this class. Borb feet. Hello, I'm a borb. Can you teach your glasses for these streams? Like, I've given up on wine on Wednesday for kids. <laughs> if you guys want, I can get some. If you guys want, I can get some glasses after this timer goes off. I don't know how they're gonna look. I've never worn glasses on my face before, but I, I can get glasses. That's easy peasy. We need Teacher V model. No! Is it Teacher V? Wouldn't that just be like Teacher is like um almost office lady, but without the, the coat? There. There's my flamingo. If I wanted to add wings, I could just make like another like 
lopsided bean shape. Oh, he's got his little triangly tail. Flamango. <laughs> the afterglow. Hello, Recyke. Look, we're drawing your cousin, the flamango. It's fl I know it's flamingo. Wasn't there a teacher, Alluris? Ah, there was a student, Alluris. I had a, a class uniform. I just like saying flamango. I know it's flamingo. This guy's pretty cute. I'm a fan. And the shrimp turns them pink. Gotta get the Yushanka trio art now. I don't I like my- I don't know. I'm trying not to dump all my money on skebs just because it's so cheap right now. I've been a bad student. I need to get punished. Oh my god. Totally not Robo Doc. Definitely not Robo. Hi, get down! Hello, hello, hello. Office Levy. If, if we get Office Lady V, I think Camelzar explodes. Is that his kink? Is Camelzar's kink Office Ladies? And I didn't know that this entire time. Also, scabs are cheap right now. Well, yeah, because the yen's really weak. Um, I just ordered a skeb for like 9,000 yen and it ended up being like 60 bucks. Pepe left. I didn't know Commissar's kink was off his ladies. <laughs> nice, nice, nice. Kami and I talked about girls in suits for fair. Wow, okay, noted. Ah, noted. Big note. Big notey hours. We got 18 seconds left. The office lady, KVB. <laughs> KVB. Yeah, because was it Commissar that commissioned that from Van? I don't actually know who commissioned that. I don't have money for that knowledge, damn yeah, I know those feels. Put your flamingos down! Alright, there's our flamingos. Our flamingos. Um, what? So you guys are gonna have homework tonight. Um, we're not gonna draw them several times because I actually have a lot of mammals that I want to get through. Um, so, but I do want you to go over your drawings and look at the reference. So I'm just, what I'm gonna do, because I always forget. I'm really bad at this, is I'm gonna go straight in there and I'm gonna throw the reference right into chat right now instead of waiting. And then you guys can look at your, your references. You can look at the reference and you can look at your drawing and I want you guys to examine what is different between the reference and your drawing. And I want you to just examine that. And that's where the studying part comes in. Okay, so while you guys take time to set up again, oh, you have this Trevor. Trevor. While you guys take time to set up again, I'm gonna go get some glasses. So just hold on one minute. I will be right back. Uh, oh, they only have sunglasses? Oh, I only have sunglasses. Is that okay? I wear my sunglasses at night so I can't do. Oh, these are funny. <laughs> Hold on. It's not very teacher-like, I'll have you know. <laughs> oh no, they fell off my face! I forgot how to like unclick a unclick a thing. Hold on, sorry. Maybe we'll do these. No, wait. yeah, let's do these. These are a little better. Oh, I know what happened. There we go. <laughs> Hello, I'm your teacher now. <laughs> Comment 
fire steak makes me think of the inevitable V cheerveader. Oh, good flamingos. Fooby, that's a very good flamingo. I'm a substitute. I'm the cool substitute teacher, guys. So, like, just don't explode pens in the back of the class and stick gum on the ceiling and we'll be cool. <laughs> Why the Top Gun soundtrack? <laughs> Alright, so our next reference Bidding is an elefante. It's very big, apparently. So we'll zoom out on this guy. Um, I think I'm gonna make him a little bit smaller because he's taking up a lot of the, the space here. And I will, uh, actually, I'm gonna. Okay, proceed. I'll just throw him up there in the thing right away. No, we're addressing him. We're gonna address him today, okay? Can I go to the library? No, you can't go to the library. There's your elephant. Little T. Come on. Come on. Work with me here, elephant. We're gonna address him. Have a good Mimi Spark. Thanks for coming. Alright, so we're gonna... I don't wanna... He's taking up... He's taking up so much space here, man. He's such a big boy. He's such a big boy. Delete. There we go. We got a little bit more space from our elephant friend. Trying not to burp. He has perceived it. Address the large land animal. That's not what I wanted. No, oh, I guess it does cut off at the top. Well, sorry guys. You're gonna have to imagine what the top of his head looks like. Oh my god, Bleach is drawing! Let's go, Bleach! Let's fucking go! Let's fucking go! Okay. Alright. Are you guys ready for the timer? These glasses are so ridiculous. It's so funny. Just give him a hat. That's true. You could just give him a hat if you really wanted to. I, oh no, I can't move them. That's okay. Alright, let's find my timer and we're gonna go in three, two, one, boop, go. Hats for everybody. Alright, so this guy's got a lot more uh, round, rotund shapes. Get, unselect the timer, please. Thank you. I'm going to be in a different layer, thank you. I keep more of a mark. He is a rotund lad, in fact. The rotundest. <laughs> Look at all those cylinders! I really thought there were more glasses. Uh, just available on on VTube Studio, but apparently there's not. I guess I'll have to go hunt down some of my own glasses. <laughs> have to hunt down some of my own. Like a big square head. Pretty sure your female elephants also have tusks. I don't think tusks are like a male only elephant trait. I made it up. We'll see. I didn't believe you, so we're all good. I'm gonna move you, elephant. You're gonna go down here. And then he's got like a like a like a this kind of cone shape on his face. He draws a Minecraft pig. Yeah, essentially. 
for real though, he does look like a Minecraft pig. <laughs> look at all them cylinders. Oh, uh, okay. Kitsu coming in with that knowledge. The knowledge. So this one that you can't super duper see it because it's behind him, but there is a little bit of a bend here and he lifted. So that means I gotta make this shorter. There's a bend and a lift. I get the proper angle. And he's got big old stretch out here. It it looks like a Minecraft bit. <laughs> I can't get that out of my head now. Mrs. didn't want to be a zoologist while she grew up. You do not have to draw its pee-pee food, we know. Unless you really want to, I guess. I don't know why you would, though. No mandatory peepees here. There's some, like, fun foreshortening going on with this trunk, which is neat. Which is super duper fun. We can kind of do something with that. And boom, you got yourself a Minecraft- I mean, elephant. Can't see its tail. You can like- because you can break it down into more, uh, complex shapes. We're just trying to keep it, um, super stupid simple. I can draw his ears, too. Uh, because next week we're gonna do real people, so that's when it's gonna get complicated. The next week we will draw the pup, the pebbles. Is it yours? Not really like a sh I'm gonna leave the rest of this in because I actually want to see it. No. I mean that's kind of what it's supposed to look like though, Gop. It's okay. You missed class last week, so it it makes sense that you're confused. Aw, oh, come on, Bleach, you're doing so well! People watching, people watching. basic shapes into four. I thought for sure four is gonna end up being Fortnite characters like yeah if he finally no no Fortnite here oh, dragon point cheese gobble <laughs> yeah forget elephant so you can you can break it down into more complicated shapes if you want to though like if there's time because then you can make the like this one's technically technically gets smaller like this so, look at Bleach go. So cute. Let's go, Bleach. Two, one. Wah, 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 wah. Ta da. That's our elephants. Joey, that's a very cute elephant. I like how small it is. You did a good job with the shapes, too. Let's see. Beaver's being overachiever again. But is also a very good elephant. He's kind of angry. Kind of looks like he belongs in My Little Pony. Arcus, good job with the shapes. I draw with pen because I'm done. Dude, most of I have a sketchbook and it's all pen drawings from when I was like in high school. And in Asgard. Jaw. <laughs> Shit, Jaws is pretty good. But also being an overachiever. Look, I'm the substitute teacher. We don't overachieve while the substitute teacher is here. Alright, so. Pink. We already did the camel. The next one is your sweet little puppy. Oh, look how round his tummy is. Oh. He 
is so sweet. Oh, look at his happy little nose. Oh, I love him so much. Oh, look at his little nose, his little soft ears. No. Guys, don't be mean to the puppy, I swear to God. Be nice to the puppy. He's cute. Be nice to him. Or her, I don't know him. It? Oh my god, I can't believe you guys are like this. I hate all of you. Is the cuteness gonna be on the test? Yes. Oh my god, you guys are so mean to this poor puppy! What elephant? It's just like mean for real, for real. It is. All right, so we're gonna um, I'll get I'll get puppy dog here situ situated here. The butter dog. I see elephants and puppy. The dog with the butter. Gonna do a quick crap a lap. There we go. What are you talking about with a butter dog? What? What? All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. I'm just gonna check a couple things while you guys get ready. Give me a minute. I've never seen the dog with the butter on its head. First start by drawing a burrito, yeah. I can, yeah. This is a burrito puppy. He's very cute. <laughs> and I'm offended that any of you dislike him. You've, you've supremely offended the VTuber. Alright, whenever you guys are ready, I'm gonna start the thing. So it'll be like 30 more seconds. Get set up. And the timer will be started. I'm just offended by all of you. Just incredibly offended. Guys keep saying butter dog like I know what that is. Oh my god, I keep yawning. <laughs> Alright. Timer start in three, two, one. Go. Alright. So he big he got big he's like the opposite of the elephant. And it's got and it's got lots of round roundness. Up, 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 up. Why can I never find things? There we go. I'm so tired of chat sheet. And then this is like a um. It's looking like a turkey. I don't know. This is like a circle with like a, a cone. Attached, really. And then he's got like a cylinder for the paw. It's like... <laughs> no! It looks like a turkey! No! Don't eat the puppy! Don't do it! Leave my puppy alone!
See, there's some foreshortening going on with the tail too, so be good. Good. And this is why we have basic shapes, because it helps with this kind of stuff. Because you could do this tail all in one piece, but it's, it it breaks it down better if you if you break it down into more pieces. I feel like I got Moon's leg up, but he's got like another shoulder blade here. And then another cylinder here. Ah! <laughs> and you could make his paw another shape, in fact. Or like a round... I don't know what the shape would be. Almost like a cone, but not quite. Seems like a general paw shape, really. And his head's like a round basketball. A giant, giant head of this puppy. I'm just not doing the back legs because I'm scared. <laughs> And this is where the reflection comes in, because like I can, I'm trying not to do this. What's driving me nuts is I can see that the head comes down a bit more, and that's the stuff you have to look at when you're going back and looking at these drawings. Because I hope, I hope you guys are going back and looking at these drawings and comparing them to the references, um, because that's where you find out what you need to work on. That's that's part of the reason why we do the iter iterative drawing process. It's you have to go back and look at um, what you did and what needs to be fixed. And then you have to draw it again, so then it's it's forcing you to correct your mistakes. And that's really where the learning comes in. I will never look back. Don't go on fast. Always look back. Look back and cringe. But a dog, the dog with the butter, but a dog, the dog with the butter on him, but a dog. Thank you, butter dog. Very wholesome. Thank you for the tip. I I feel like that text to speech sounds almost like Zen Treya. Like, almost. Not quite. But very close. Yeah. I haven't watched one of the Zen streams in quite some time, though. Beaver's struggling a little bit with the puppy. That's okay. That's okay. What? Puppy's not easy. Puppy's got a lot going on. Puppy looks like puppy would be easy, but puppy not easy. This also, um, this kind of stuff also teaches you guys how to draw from reference, which is extremely important as an artist. So, like, once you get the skills needed to do that, drawing anything becomes significantly easier. And then his little ear over here. It's a puppy! Just in time! Seven, six, five, four, three... Two, one. <laughs> There's your puppy dog. What a dog. Puppet doggo. Yeah, kinda. Got a gut thing afro. <laughs> what? Alright, so the next one beep, is. Oh, we only got two more, which is actually good, because I, like I said, I didn't want to stream for the full two hours today. I'll let you guys get your puppies up. See, Fubi made a burrito. Fantastic. Um, I'll let you guys get your, your, uh, your drawings up, and then I'll throw up our, our, our lad. Our large lad here. I've been staring at Twitch for almost two hours since her finished. No, Drifter! No! 
I'm not going back to Twitch till February. He's like, when is when is Recite gonna raid me? When is that gonna happen? Fubi Fubi taking uh taking the advanced course with the burrito. I forgot the butter. Remember the butter reefers. Man, look at you looking all badass. I'm the, yeah, they didn't have any teacher um they didn't have any teacher glasses. This is the best I could do. It helps to make food first. I'll uh, I'll check the I'll check it after stream got Nick. Alright, I think I think we got everyone's dogs in our puppy, so I'm gonna post panda. Maybe there you go. Thank you, Discord. Ugh. Yeah, so we got the panda and then one more and then we'll we'll call it a night. Now you can join the cool club with me and well <laughs> I'm uh I'm excited to go back to Twitch. I never thought I'd say that, but it's weird. I mean, Twitch just has- I mean, they're both kind of garbage in their own way, but... YouTube is a, a whole nother animal. <laughs> Have a good Nini, Gop! Gotta end me. They all garbage. Still better than Facebook. Yeah, 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 yeah. I agree. Ah! I'm not doing Facebook streaming. That's not happening. Sloth bear. <laughs> sun bears are very cute. And I also heard that sun bears are very vicious. Um, I think they're cute, though. So are pandas. Pandas are also cute. I'm just trying to give everyone time to get set up again so we're not, like, scrambling to get, get going before I start the timer again. Drop bear win. Isn't that just a um? It's not just a koala. It's drop bear, not just a koala. Thank you. Hello, otter. Thank you. Those are like the worst bear ever. They're so horrible being bears, even if they are cute. It's true. Oh my god! You stop yawning. What the heck? Ugh. All right, are we ready? We're gonna get the timer going. They're edited photos of koalas. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure they're just koalas. Pins are trying to die and we won't let them. Well, look how cute they are. It's actually named after the red panda. That's right, we were first. Well, you just wait, Arcus, you just wait. All right, time to start the timer in three, two, one. My glasses are wonky. I just want to die. Nope, that's not. That's not what I wanted. Okay. Okay, we all around. I got. I, I realized, besides the flamingo, um, I found a lot of round <laughs> animals. I was trying to change up the shapes a little bit when I was looking. I was also trying to find them at like different angles where like things were overlapping and things like that. Um, but a lot of them ended up being kind of like chonky boys. This guy's kind of nice though because you can kind of... <laughs> His markings help with the shapes. I think this actually... Okay, hold on. Let me start over. I think it actually needs to be more of like a bean shape. Less of a circle. No, shut up, Commissar. This one's hard. Why is this one hard? This one's hard. I feel like I'm not drawing it big enough. Kick <laughs> camels are. I 
I'm struggling with the panda. Maybe, okay, let me break it down this way. If you're struggling with something, try a new approach. There you go, that's better. Okay, we got it. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna guess the panda does not know Kung Fu. Just a guess, though. I could be wrong. Doing big think hours. Brain neurons activating. Um, and tomorrow... Oh, I need to talk to Recyc. Recyc, are you still here? Recyc? Recyc? I don't think he's here anymore. Every time I remember to talk to him about stuff, he's sleeping. And I don't want to message him because I'm like 85% sure I wake him up. He says I don't, but I feel like I do. He's doing the big stretch. He's got a big stretch. Sorry, I'm trying not to move the reference too much. For you guys. I got, I, got a little, I got a message him about uh, moving warlords. I don't want to take up his, uh, his smash tourney. Well, I mean, like, because, like, people message me, but I'm sleeping. So then I just, you know, I sleep. But then he always answers, even though it's like, I know it's three in the morning there. And I'm like, I know I'm waking you up. He's like, no, 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 you're not. I'm like, I, I don't think I am not waking you up. That's why she takes so much to reply. One day there's going to be a fire and you're going to be sleeping. So lazy. Sleeping during the day. So lazy. <laughs> I got little cylinders for ears. Oh, look at little ears. Not really. Well, this one kind of looks like a cylinder, but that this one kind of looks like a cylinder, but this one doesn't. And then he's kind of got like a thing. You don't. The lad doesn't have a tail. He's also got a bigger belly. He's very Winnie the Pooh. He's got a very <laughs> Winnie the Pooh thing going on. Oh yeah, I should draw his muzzle. That'd be good. Got a minute left. Might as well. It's funny because there's some animals I pulled out. I'm like, man, people are going to struggle with this one. And then other ones, I was like, man, it's going to be super easy. And it seems to be the opposite. The ones I thought would be easy are hard. And the ones I thought would be hard are easier for people, it looks like. What did I say the thing? What thing did I say? It looks like he's like stretching, but it also looks like he's like riding up for like a slap bite. I think. Oh, yeah. That. That stuff. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. I feel like this shoulder also needs to like come up more. Like, I feel like the shape needs to be more like this. It's better for him in doing planks if he does at the gym, yeah. I gotta figure out what to do. Um, I haven't been to the gym since I hurt my back because I don't want to make it worse. But I gotta figure out what to do. Because um, I, from what I was reading back, issues take like several weeks to. Dang, 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 timer up. Um, back issues take several weeks to, to fix themselves. So I think when I go back to the gym next week, I'm still gonna have to take it easy. Easy on the back. So. I 
six weeks a month depending on how severe it is yeah i don't think mine was like super duper severe i think it just hurt a lot because there were a lot of things happening at the same time because like i said like today it still hurts but it's like significantly better i mean i'm going i was going from like i think like a like a eight on a paid skill down to like a one or two so Fubia's bear looked like it just got hit with a flashbang. <laughs> I like the body shape though. That's a very good body shape. It's very beany. It's very like a bean. I have I have a heating pad, which I've been using. Um, I'm actually using it right now, which is probably the only reason why I can sit here this long. It's also it's also been kind of messy with a bear from some book. <laughs> yes. It's, uh, it's, yeah, because I've been trying not to sit on it as much as I can, which kind of sucks because I have to for my big girl job, but. Congratulations, Bleach. All right, so we will move on to our very last thing. Don't worry, we're not starting quite yet, but our last uh, victim of the night shall be the one and only Red Panda. That's very cute and very happy. It's still not better. Oh. I'm sorry. Yeah! <laughs> Duality of man. Look how happy the lad is. Hmm. Am I back? It's, it's showing green on my thing. Nope. Are we good? Are we good? It's green? Are we moving? Are we moving? Are we good? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Riot? Hello? Riot, someone's killing them! I was where my internet decided it didn't want to be alive. But now it's back. Maybe it's the snow. I think it's still snowing. I don't know. Hello. Welcome back. We're so close. The nice thing about YouTube, see this is a nice thing between YouTube and Twitch though, is that Twitch would have cut the stream, because I did come back for a second on my screen. So they would have cut the stream there when I lost connection. Would have blurped that little thing into like a second chunk of VOD. And then this would be a third chunk of VOD. But YouTube just keeps it all together. So. That's like one of the few advantages of YouTube. Because it's really annoying. When Twitch does that. <laughs> but we will focus on our Mammonimal. We are back. Okay, let's... I think you guys had enough time to set up then. <laughs> so let me just shrink this lead. Twitch does have a thing now to secure the stream? What do you mean secure it, though? What's that? So I just saw... Um, I think it was Zen. I think it was Zentria complaining about how it, it cuts the stream up. And you can't stick it back together. She's just complaining about it today. Well, mine go. Yeah, keep it. Oh, weird. I'll have to take a look at that. I was too busy panicking. Man, last one of the night, and it's gotta be fluffy. Alright, I'm gonna start the timer. In three. Oh no, comments are screaming. In three, two, should I be considering recording a vlog for Sunday? I've never considered bothering. You mean a VOD? Um, so if you're streaming on Twitch, it automatically records it and automatically posts it up unless you tell it not to. So you don't have to do anything special on your end for it to post up a VOD. It'll just, it, it handles all that for you. A lot of people forget. I think you have to turn it on, actually. A lot of people forget to turn it on. 
But it's nice because if people miss your stream, they can go back and watch it. And then they, if they like your stuff, they can follow you from that. Um, VODs are only up on Twitch, though, for uh, non-affiliates and affiliates for 14 days. So there's that bit of info for you if anyone's thinking about streaming. Yeah, okay, you do have to turn it on. Okay, I can never remember. It's been so long. All right, we're going to start in three, two, one. Ah, blah, 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 blah. This is a long boy. Sounds like more trouble than it's worth for a tiny debut. I mean, it's not, it's literally no trouble. You just hit one button and it's on. That's it. It's, it's literally zero trouble. I would, um, unless you're doing something that might get hit with copyright, I would always encourage people to put on VODs. Because Twitch has such uh, bad discoverability that VODs at least help people get an idea about what your streams are about. If they do happen to stumble upon you. So. I think the only time you wouldn't want a VOD is if you're doing something like karaoke with copyrighted music or something like that. His legs be do be doing weird stuff. And if you advertise right, it could, it's really easy to hit affiliate. So if you advertise right, if you don't advertise right, then it could it, it can be impossible. But if you advertise correctly and, uh, you know, grow your, grow your stuff, you can hit affiliate pretty quickly. Well, uh, Robo, you're the only person that I know of that has randomly found me on Twitch. So out of the, the 20, what, 23, no, 20, wow. The 1300 ish people that follow me on Twitch, I've got one of you. So. Now, I could be wrong. There could be people that found me randomly, but they haven't stuck around enough to tell me that, so. It's got such soft paws. I wish to pet them. I found you randomly on Facebook, but not Twitch. Yep, see? <laughs> Easy clap. Yeah, Twitch is set up so you, if you want to grow on Twitch, you have to uh, you have to use other social media platforms. Like, and, they, and they've specifically said that too. Like, if you're just... You can't just stream... I mean, I guess you can kind of. Um, but the... You really can't just stream. I think that's where a lot of people get stuck. It's because they think if they just stream for 12 hours you know, a day they'll, they'll make it big and that's just not the case anymore. Not, not post cough. Got a cute little triangle ear. You know, and I keep saying that and you know, it, it, it's, it's a, it's a thing, you know, and people always argue with me. They're like, well, if I just stream enough people, I'll get, I'll get big on Twitch. Well, that's not true, but okay, pop off. I mean, yeah, if you want to remain unobserved and you just want to chill in your streams, more power to you. You know, that's cool too. There's nothing wrong with that. Like, I keep thinking this leg looks weird, but then like this leg also <laughs> looks weird. Like, I don't know what's going on with it. Like. It almost looks like it's just like broken, you know? Like it looks broken.
Did you forget about fur with animals? We're not drawing fur, though. Oh, are you mean like... Oh, you mean like the fur is making it look weird? Is that what you mean? <laughs> yeah, that could be it. That could be the fur. I think it's the fur and then the mix of the, the grass covering up parts. <laughs> That, this looks cursed. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not a fan of this one. Like, this, this paw is messed up because it doesn't, it looks like it's broken. These things look like hairless cat shed. Oh my god, I've never seen a shaved red panda. Why pandas be like that? I feel like they're made of jelly. Well, see, I think, like, part of it is I made this part, like, too long. Yeah, see, that looks better. Hello, North! Timer done! That's it, guys. That's the last one. We did it. We made it through. Internet hiccups and all. Which which one which animal was your favoriteest animal to draw, guys? <laughs> I was like, yeah, guys, we did it, yeah. The body is a jelly bean, then the legs are chicken legs. <laughs> oh, look at ammonia drawing! Oh, elephants. I think my favorite was the flamingo, but also the panda. The panda was hard, but I like the panda. Oh, Fubi, that's good. Oh no. Burrito, chips, toilet paper tube, ham. Fubi's just gonna draw inanimate objects into, into things now. <laughs> that's how Fubi's gonna become a master artiste. I would like to meet a red panda one day. They look very soft. I think they would also bite though. They look like they nibble. They look like they like to take a big nibble. Hope you discovered a new talent, yes. Red panda was harder by far, but also very cute. It's true. It's like the cute makes up for the hardness. Fubi might be hungry. Yeah, Fubi's drawn a lot of food. Glasses on YouTube both failed at the same time. Rip. <laughs> Everything is made of food. Everything is cake! Everything is cake! They bite the way puppies do? Yeah, see, that does not... They look like they bite the way puppies do. Look at this guy. He looks like... He looks like he bites the way puppies do. Look at his face. Look at him. It looks like he's gonna nibble your finger off. Look at him. It's an absolute mess. Otters are also very mean. He does look mischievous. He looks like he's gonna like take my bag and like destroy it. And then not actually take anything. Just just causing like a little bit of havoc. As one does. As one diddly do. But yes. We have done it, guys. I hope... How are you guys feeling about these sorts of streams? How are you guys feeling? Are they good? Do you think they need to be longer? Shorter? Is there any... Does anyone have any requests that they would like covered? I'm happy to, you know, you know, hear about that kind of stuff. Because I have my plan, but I'm happy to, you know, help other people. And I draw curse animals because it's fun. Yay! Okay, good. Kill this creature like a baby and go off and do errands. No, I agree. I would also do that. These are fun. Oh my god, Ammonia had fun! Oh my god, we're converting non-artists into artists, guys. I'm missing half of them due to small brain. It's gonna be really bad when I swap back to Twitch and everyone's gonna be sitting on YouTube going, Where's the stream? I'm just gonna pull a Pippa and like, set up a stream on YouTube telling everybody to go to Twitch. 
I like them, they're fun. I'm worried I might not be able to make the future ones if they stay on Thursday, though. Um, they probably will be staying on Thursday. Or stream. <laughs> Maybe monsters one day. Oh, that would be fun. I mean, I'm just doing this for fun instead of trying to improve, so do whatever you want. Let's find the moon to draw. Good, 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 good. Can we do a chicken? Yeah, um, do you guys want to do like one chicken? One, one chicken? I can find a chicken quick if you guys would like. Uh, I was gonna do a chicken and I decided not to because chickens are relatively simple, but we can do a fun chicken. Let me find a crazy looking chicken. Oh, I know, I know. You guys want to see a crazy chicken? Hold on. Oh my god. Uh, hold on, let me- Oh, I'm trying to find a picture that's not too horrifying. There you go. <laughs> I don't know. It's, they're kind of gross, but they're really neat, but also kind of gross. Here we go. Okay, this one's not too messed up. His butt do be- Okay, here we go. Oh my god, this guy looks like he's ready to square up and kill somebody. Okay, guys. Guys. Um, this- I'm gonna warn you right now, these are not the prettiest chickens. Um, but they are very interesting to look at. So just, just be aware. Um, yeah. Here you go. It's called a dragon chicken. Dragon. I don't know that. I think they're Vietnamese. They're very expensive birds. They're extremely expensive. To the point where someone got like three years in prison for trying to smuggle them out of Vietnam. I think they're Vietnamese. Yeah, they- okay, yeah, they're Vietnamese. They're actually meat chickens, and, um, they're slaughtered to be eaten on the Lunar New Year, I believe? I think they're cute, too! But they also are kind of horrifying. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it's gonna- it's gonna wreck <laughs> It's gonna ruin some lives right now. I did tell my mom to get one. She said no. She said they're gross, and I was sad. Irish music plays. So yeah, we will draw. We will draw a dragon chicken. Yeah, yeah, it was recent. All right, so I'll set up the timer. If you guys want to get ready for the last one, we'll do a chicken. A piece de resistance, if you will. What's up, Bleach? Yeah, they're like hyper expensive. They're super duper expensive. They're crazy. Oh yeah, I will post a reference. Okay, thank you, thank you for reminding me. It loading. Boom. Boom. There you go. Alright. Dong Tao chicken can go for like 25. Dong Tao. Yes, that is, that is what they're called. They're fancy. Fancy chimkins. And they're only bred in um, Vietnam. You can't get them outside of Vietnam. <laughs> so it's already made of food. Alright guys, I'm gonna start the timer. In three... No, <laughs> three, two, one. Pink! Be a beast. So he's got... Uh, this one's a... Yeah, he do... You could probably uh, do like a paint over and make this guy into a space marine. I'm gonna be honest with you. He's a solid fellow. You guys learned about you guys learned about chickens today. How does that make you feel? Yeah, I think they're really pretty. Some of them, like they're the thing is that kind of makes them kind of gross. Like their legs on some of them are kind of yucky looking, um, but then like their chests are also uh, bare. 
Like you can kind of see it on this one right here and it's bright pink and like red. Like it's not the prettiest scaly type thing. So I, I know why, I understand why they call them dragon chickens though. I think I would also call them dragon chickens. I would honestly sit and watch a documentary about these chickens though. It's so interesting. So interesting. Maybe we'll just do that on Warlord's Night. We'll just watch a documentary about Dong Tao chickens. <laughs> Unfortunately, you can't see him on his feet, but you can assume that his other feet are shaped like this. This um, cone type shape. On duty for warlords. We're, uh, we're moving it. So, I don't know if you saw. Because I don't think I can sit for three nights in a row. Um, I just gotta, I gotta organize with the recyc and make sure I don't move it to in front of his, uh, his, his smash tourney. So, I don't want to overlap that. So it's not, it's not this Saturday, just because of my back. Just join the tournament, just make that Warlord's Night. I'm so bad at Smash. I'm so bad at it. Warlord's Night, yeah! So, uh, the Warlord tier on my coffee, every month we have, normally it's the last Saturday of the month, um, but we all play like a community night type game situation, so sometimes it's uh, Jackbox, sometimes it's been Crab Game, we've done movie watch-alongs, um, and then this Saturday was supposed to be karaoke. So, I messed this up, he's facing the wrong direction. That's okay. An easy, e wow! Thank you, Commissar. Yes, they're gonna represent me. Because I'm sure they're significantly better. I believe in them. This guy is really, like, popping off. Like, he looked like he about to attack. Also, their heads seem really small compared to the rest of their bodies. A little beak. <laughs> it's like the umbrella cord for issue of the tea by the chicken. It's waddle. This is a very good dynamic uh dynamic thing. His head's kind of square, actually. He's kind of got like a square head going. I need to stop crossing my leg. That hurts my back. Me. I'm back in history for two hours. I think an hour and a half. So good at this. So good at this. I think I need to make his like actual body bigger. I'm just some old dude with his hands behind his back when I see the spirit. Yeah. This guy looks like a kung fu master. This guy looks like he could mess up the panda with his kung fu skills. I think, I can't tell, this might be his tail and not his wing. I think that might be his tail. The Asian turtle man pose, yes. The actual chicken, the chicken attack. Well, actually, like, roosters can mess you up. Like, uh, my <laughs> all mother got attacked by, but she doesn't have the rooster anymore, but she got attacked by one of her roosters and it cut her. It, it ripped her pants and cut her. Like, the, the pant leg. It didn't, it didn't, uh, it didn't stay long after that. Yeah, see, I thought it was wing too, but like now that I'm staring at it, I think it might be his tail. 
I don't know though. Just because like these long feathers make me think it's his tail. Those don't really look like flight feathers. This guy, I uh, I don't think can fly. We're all done. All the chickens on our farm because he hated the roosters and the turkeys. <laughs> all right, guys, that is our last last one. We did a crazy looking chicken. Yeah, my mom has had some really good roosters that were super nice and super protective of the flock, but like knew not to attack other people. And then she's had some really nasty ones that just attack anything that moves, including the chickens. Ammonia, like, I really like your chicken. Um, it kind of looks like it's the Punisher. Like, he kind of looks like he's gonna, um, hunt down any and all bad guys that slaughtered his family. My mom was stuck in the chicken coop all day as my brother was at school because of I grow chicken. Thank you. That is a nice chicken drawing. Look at you guys go. Buckock! Booby with her meat again. Chicken, 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 chicken. I'm not repeating that one word. Hey, Booby, those legs are really good though. Solid. Very solid legs. I, you did a good job with the joints. Joints look good. Chicken, 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 chicken. And that is it, guys. We'll call it a night there, because my back is starting to get twingy. Uh, tomorrow, I'm streaming tomorrow. Just so you know. You're screwed 16D character. Uh, we'll be playing Valheim! We're gonna play Valheim! We're gonna prep for, um, the Elder. So, it'll probably be more of a chill stream. Probably collect some copper, see what kind of armor I can make, or upgrade the armor I have. Might, might attempt to kill some more trolls. We'll see if I can go... Uh, Ultra Instinct and maybe get some more troll skin to upgrade my armor. But yeah, so it'll be fun. It'll be, we can chat a little bit. I feel like we haven't like really gotten a whole lot of time to just chit chat, you know? So. That is in fact a chicken marine. Yes, thank you guys for coming. I will see you tomorrow at the same time. Have a good night. Peace.